Thursday night in Reynolds Coliseum, NC State women's basketball hosted an SEC opponent. The Vanderbilt Commodores came knocking at the door for GoPack.com with Ernie Myers. My name is Andrew Sanders, and uh, Ernie, NC State got off to a bit of a slow start. It was a, a tightly contested first quarter. Yeah, they, both teams were feeling each other out. Uh, the defensive intensity in the first quarter was, was pretty high, uh, but State kind of figured it out uh, as the game progressed. Leslie, ace for the three, uh, and Conan. Uh, I think she played uh, for Sulis, uh, and she didn't start, and she played, she played her head up. She had uh, 10.6 rebounds. For Sulis had 11, 12 points and 11 rebounds. She had a double-double, but uh, she played great against her. Yeah, going up against uh, one of the best centers on the women's college basketball court, and Elisa Kinane fared very well. Zerny gave you the numbers, and, and she was one of four Wolfpack players to score in double figures. Kira Leslie led the way with 21 points. Ernie, Ace Koenig with 16, uh, Grace Hunter with 13. But it was really Leslie's night. Yeah, it was Leslie's night. I thought this was her coming out. This was the best game she's played so far this season. Um, came up right when the Wolfpack needed her. Uh, uh, she got hurt in the, seemed like, in the latter part of the game. But... Uh, seems like she's going to be all right. But Jones, Crutchfield, uh, again, another total team effort. Yeah, a well-balanced attack uh, from the Wolfpack. And once again, that lockdown defense as they held Vanderbilt to just 35% shooting on the night. And once again, Westmore's group wins the rebounding battle. And those points off turnovers, the difference maker. NC State next in action against Radford on the 18th. 